Hello everyone, my name is Adam Repos Vox, and in this video we're going to be taking a quick look at the Windows 10 camera app because it has updated and changed for Windows 10. Hopefully for the better as I absolutely could not stand Windows 8's camera app. It was just awful. It was just awful. So we're going to go ahead and take a look. So we're going to hit start and I'm going to type in camera. And it's right there at the top. It's a trusted Windows Store app. So I'm going to click it. It's going to pull it up here. We're going to make it uh, let it access my location. Sure, why not? I'm going to put it maximized here. I'm still getting my frame rate. And look at that. It has face detection. This is not something that's a feature of my webcam. I'm using the Logitech C920. This is a feature of the app. So it's actually detecting my face and adjusting my webcam's focus, even though it's not a Microsoft webcam, for my face. Yeah, it works pretty well. That's pretty cool. Let's look at the settings we have. There's a self timer, which is good. That's returned from the other version. Settings. Press and hold the camera button. It'll take videos or photo bursts or disabled. You can control that. You can set it whether it's going to be 4x3 or 16x9. You can set up a framing grid. I like that. And then you can set up what kind it is. Golden ratio, crosshair, square, rule of thirds. I'm going to use rule of thirds. Video recording. Wow, you can even control what it records video at. And this is going to change a bit based on what uh, webcam you have. My webcam record, can record up to 1080p, 30 frames per second. We have other options here as well if you want to lower it. Flicker redu reduction for various screens and lights, 60 hertz for the US. And then you can change where the photos and videos are saved, which is really good. So we're going to click that and change that real quick. Did you mean to switch apps? Yep, I sure did. Let's go ahead and switch and look at this real quick. New documents will save too. Wow, this is a really crappy system to be honest, but we're going to save new music to G. We're going to save new pictures to G. We're going to save new videos to I. We're going to save new documents to G. That way my solid state drive is not being abused by these apps. All right, let's take a couple pictures. Oh, I may have just, there we go. Now it loaded the settings. All right, what's this icon up here? Face detection, auto face detection for autofocus. You have exposure control. Whoa! I am Batman. Set that back up. I believe that was even. I'm gonna turn that setting off. Close that menu. We got an icon over here to view our camera roll, which we have in the new Photos app. But I haven't taken any pictures, so let's take some selfies. And then let's take a video. I don't know what microphone this is using, but it's probably using the webcam microphone. This is a test. Test, test. One, two, three. Oh, is that record? Nope. It's recording now. Okay, I don't know what... Uh, hello? Test, test. I don't understand. I must have misclicked it the first time. I don't know what microphone this is recording. It's probably using my C920 microphone. Test, test. One, two, three. Test, test. One, two, three. And then I'll hit stop record. Boom. And it's done recording. Okay. Yeah, so basically you switch between video and camera mode. Okay, so now we click the collections icon to bring up the photo app, and you can view the picture I just took, and they don't actually look all that bad. I'm not going to play that. Yeah, that's pretty cool. Oh, is that record? No, nope. it's recording now. Okay, I don't know what, uh, hello, test, test, I don't understand, I must have misclicked it the first time. I don't know what microphone this is recording, it's probably using my C920 microphone. Test, test, one, two, three, test, test, one, two, three. And then I'll hit it. All right, so this is the Windows 10 camera app, and I have to say, it has the Epos Vox seal of approval. It, it's not the best, but it is a lot better than Windows 8's camera app was. Windows 8's camera was terrible. So, hope you enjoyed the video guys, as always, thank you so much for watching, be sure to leave a like, comment, and subscribe to the channel for more awesome Windows 10 videos as well as tech videos in general, and I will see you in a future video. I don't, I'm lost.